Hi guys! Are you ready for a story about great people, amazing nature and challenges that you're just faced with and have to deal with? In that case, I have a story for you. This here is my story about the journey so far. Let's go for it! It all started with this tiny lady, Lillemor, a tour 80 which I lived on in Trumse for one year before setting sail 8th of June 2018. We were four people on board, Ruth, one of my dear friends, Tim, her boyfriend, and Lassa, another one of my very best friends, and me. Naturally, we also had two four-legged friends with us, my dear Findus and Lassa's lovely little shadow. Our bow was turned toward the south, and after a few days we were in Faxjorn, where we could enjoy some luxury with some landbound adventure, a warm house and really good food. A rather nice stop before the journey onwards. Sailing on, we were headed towards Lofoten, a true sailor's paradise. After Lofoten, it was just Lasse and me and our two beautiful dogs on board. Root and Tim had some land-based adventures to get on with. We had some absolutely wonderful sunny shiny days down the coast and with the magical midnight sun in the night, the journey onward was nothing less than magical. Eventually we found ourselves at Trana where it was time for festival music, friends, and beautiful nature. After Trana, Lasse and Shadow went back home to Trumsa, while I got company from Vibeka. It was time for a girl sail. That leg brought us to Rødvik, where great changes was ahead. I was going to sell Lillemor and set up Morocco to give my mom some peace and quiet. It took me almost two months and an entire budget to get Morocco ready but eventually we were. The first sail was done together with my dad and my big sister. It brought us from Lovea to Rødvik to fill up on fuel and to wave goodbye to my dear dad, previously skipper on Morocco. We were ready to continue the adventure, to see the ocean and the world. Together with me was my dear big sister Yuna and Kevin, a friend I made during my time in Rødvik. And of course, Findus was there, my dear loyal ship dog. The rest of the Norwegian coast was ahead of us and what an adventure it would be. But Morocco's adventure along the Norwegian coast, you'll just have to wait for. For now, I'm saying thanks for watching and see you soon. Oh, no, I'm going to